Yo guys, welcome back to Techno Game. Before two years, Nvidia has launched the 4000 series and it brought a major leap in performance compared to the 3000 series, offering up to double performance without DLSS and up to four times the performance with DLSS 3 enabled. And as the release of the 5000 series approaches, will we see the same performance leap? That's what we will find out in this video. The RTX 5000 series with the new features will come with a black well architecture. Okay, it's the first major shift we will witness is the type of memory, which is GDDR7. And in fact, this isn't just a leak, it's a confirmed reality because Samsung has already launched this memory. We will see faster data transfer speed thanks to GDDR7, which promises a significant boost in performance and efficiency compared to the previous generation. And as the leaks have stated, the 5090 consumes around 150 watt more than 4090, and the 5080 consumes around 80 watt more than 48. And as we know, consuming more power means better performance. And according to the video game website, they received information suggesting that the 5080 will outperform the 4090 by 10%. From this, we can conclude that the 5080 will be about 40% better than the 4080 in general performance. And this is a huge advance. If the 5080 is like this, what will the 5090 be like? As for the prices, I don't think the 5000 series will be cheaper than the 4000 series, but there will definitely be a noticeable difference in performance. So if you're looking to build a PC right now, I advise you to wait until the release of the 5000 series cards, as they will offer a better value, especially in the budget categories, like the 5050 and the 5060 cards. 